Yo, what is up, you guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today, I am going to be doing something that has been a little bit trendy lately, but I just don't know if it is trendy anymore because I'm probably like one of the last people to do this trend. There is a new video trend where you basically post on your Instagram story and say, hey guys, write an assumption about me. <coughs> And we're going to go through today and see what you assume about my life. I don't like when people assume things about me, but I'm making it into a video. Have you guys like, ever had that feeling like where like someone like, you know, thinks something about you, but it's totally like off? So we're going to find out today and see if these are correct or if they're going to be wrong. We're going to be straight up honest. That's all that matters is honesty. I just like went through and screenshot like a bunch of them. And just go through every single one and see who's talking. <laughs> and who's being really nice, so yeah. But before I do start the video, if you guys could, please give this video a big thumbs up, you guys. Don't forget to subscribe, also press the notification bell, and I also wanna give a big shout out to Borna Clur for being the shout out person of the week, you guys. Thank you so freaking much love for having my notifications on, subscribing, liking the video, and of course, commenting, pick me down below. You are amazing. Go and sub up to Borna Clur. Thank you so much again, I really appreciate that. You're absolutely amazing. If you guys wanna be the next week's shout out video, all you guys have to do is like this this video, subscribe, hit the bell so you guys can notify when I post new videos, and also comment down below, pick me. That just shows that you guys want to be in the challenge to be in the next video, so yeah. But let's get started, you guys. We have a lot of people talking so, uh, le le <laughs> seriously, uh, let's just go through you guys and see what people have to say. The first assumption says you care about your fans. That is very, very true. So there's actually a funny story about this. So I was at an Ariana Grande concert in Indianapolis. There was two girls that came to the show, but they didn't go to the show for Ariana. They went to the show to see me in the lobby waiting to go inside the venue to go see Ariana. So I bought them tickets to go inside the show because they drove all the way to the venue just to come see me because they knew I was going to be there. And I thought that was like the sweetest thing in the world. So yeah. The next assumption says that you are very shy in person. Um, I'm very shy, but like once you know me or I know you well enough, then you're gonna wish I was really still shy, so yeah. But someone said you miss It's Just Nick. Yes, I do. I see It's Just Nick this weekend. Brent and I are really excited because maybe we're gonna film together. I don't know. Maybe he's gonna be busy. Probably won't, but Brent and I love him and Anthony. They're so cute together and oh my god. But someone says that you wish Brent lived in Ohio. That is very, very true. I wish he was because it would be easier on like our lives. So we don't have to like fly back and forth. It gets pricey. It's just, it's so much. So if he lived here with me, you guys would, you know, there'd be so much more content on YouTube. There'd be so much more cute videos. We'd probably start actually vlogging and stuff. I I think I would want to do that once he moves in soon, maybe, wink wink. So, yeah, vlogs, brick vlogs, uh, yes. Someone said you've never had sex with a girl. That is very, very true. I've never had sex with a girl. Uh, that doesn't, you know, that doesn't mean like, oh, well, then how do you know you're gay? I like dudes. I don't see girls the same as I do with guys. Does it make sense? I don't know. Someone said you smell nice. Well, thank you. <laughs> I love smelling nice. I hope I smell nice. Someone says you're the jealous type. It depends, okay? If I know, like, you know, Brandon's like messing around, like, I'm not really jealous, you know what I mean? Like, if he's like, oh, like, who I'm looking for, mess, I'm like, okay. But if, you know, if there's like someone like hitting on him, and I'm like, okay, am I not hot? No, I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, I get jealous though because I'm like, wait, like, that's my boyfriend, like, back up, so yeah. <laughs> I'm so stupid, oh my god. Someone says, you dislike cocky people. That is very, very true. I don't like cocky people. Like, get out of my life if you're cocky. I don't like you. Ah! It's just, it's ridiculous. Like, don't be cocky. Like, you know, stay humble. Someone says, you don't really care much for your dad. That is a lie. I love my dad. It's just we don't see each other because he's basically all the way in Tennessee right now doing stuff and you know what I mean? So, um, but once he comes back up to Ohio, then we'll, you know, we'll hang out more and stuff and yeah. Go fishing, do manly things. <laughs> I don't like fishing though. <laughs> Someone says, you've never seen a nude. That's a fat lie. Next question. Someone says, you don't miss your coconut head. Okay, I don't miss my long hair at all. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, here's a photo right here. Like, I do not miss that. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> Comment down below, do you guys like that hair or no? Like, I don't know. Someone says, you're not too insecure. I'm actually really insecure about a few things. My forehead, my jawline that I have to like, kind of like, Suck it. I'm just kidding. No, that's ugly, but just a few things. Not like a lot. My acne. Oh my god, I have like acne like on my back and say, ugh, it's just gross. I, I'm like insecure. You're insecure. Don't know what. Okay, I'm gonna shut up. Someone says you like cats. I love pussy. I mean cats. Same thing, right? Someone says you lost your virginity at 15. Okay, younger. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, no, like, virgin, like, what kind? Like, you know, like, everything? No. Um, little things? Yes. Younger. Younger. So, yeah. Not like, not like that. Like, not like, 
Okay. Next person said, I think you love fashion and clothing. Literally, I wear the same clothes every week. I will wear like the baseball shirt, this hoodie. Like I probably wore this hoodie like five times this week already. I mean, it's a hoodie though. I mean, it's, you know, it's nice. It's comfy. Someone says that you hate being woken up in the morning early. If it's something important, then I don't mind. But if it's like something stupid, like I, you know, like I just wake up and I can't go back to sleep. Like, I'm, ooh, I'm so pissed. Like, oh my God. Like, don't wake me up. I need my beauty rest, right? Yeah. Someone says, you can get really petty when you're fighting with someone. Oh my god. Like, I'm that type of person that like will not talk to someone for like the longest time. They piss me off. Like, you know what I mean? Like, it's I don't know why. It's just how I am. Like, you know, I know I'm not wrong in the situation. Well, like, I always think I'm not wrong. <laughs> that sounds so awful. No, but like, I, I just, I, I don't do anything like wrong, but you know what I mean? I don't know. It's just me though. So, just ignore me. Someone says, you like to sleep naked. No. Okay, well, I don't want my mom to like walk in on me. I mean, I could lock the door, but still, I just feel weird. Like, I like having, you know, at least something on. No. <laughs> Someone says, you're fit. By the way, that's effing true. Love you. I love you too, and I'm not fit, guys. I need to go to the gym. Anyone want to be a gym buddy? Like, come on, let's go work out together. Let's have like a little, maybe like a little Chipotle date after our gym sessions and just kind of like eat what we just worked off and stuff. And yeah, there's no point in that, so. Someone says, you're not going to college. That's a lot. I do want to go to college. It's just really pricey, it's expensive, and I want to, it's just, I don't know what I want to go for yet. I want to be a dentist, maybe a dental hygienist, maybe, I don't know. But something that's like not too hard, I don't know, but like, I don't know. I just don't know if I want to like deal with like, I don't know, so yeah. Someone says cheating on Brandon with Ariana Grande. No, I couldn't, no matter how much I love Ariana Grande, you guys, I could never, ever, ever cheat. Like there's no point to cheat. It's so stupid. It's so, cool. it's just, it's dumb. Like if you're not happy, like in a relationship, then leave. You know what I mean? Like why do you have to go, you know, above and beyond just to like cheat on someone? Like that's so stupid. And I could never cheat on Brandon. Like I love my baby too much, so. Someone says you want to move to New York. That is, no. <laughs> That's, that's false. I don't want to move to New York. I love visiting there, but I could never live there. I mean, maybe like up, you know, like out of the city, kind of a little bit, but I want to be like able to like drive to the city, but not live in the city. Does that make sense? Maybe, but no. Someone said you were popular in school. I was that one kid that kind of basically just you know, did their own thing, and I was cool with everyone. I didn't have a problem with you, didn't have a problem with you. If you like me, I like you. If we're cool, we're cool. It wasn't like, you know, oh, I'm Mr. Popular. That's why I left my school. I'm just kidding, no. Um, I just, <laughs> I just wasn't like the popularest. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know. Someone says, your favorite show on Netflix is Friends. I actually never seen Friends before in my life. Probably because I don't have friends. I'm just kidding. No, but I never seen that show, actually. Don't hate me, don't attack me, but yeah. Uh, someone says you don't get mad easily. That's a lie I mean like the littlest things can like annoy me and irritate me like which builds up, you know over time But I kind of like keep it in a little bit and then like I just like kind of like, you know, go boom That's that's how I get mad. So someone says you get hot temperature wise. Oh, I thought you meant like, you know Like thanks, you know what I'm saying? But like you said, but that is true though. I do get really really hot um, I'm surprised like I'm not burning up like in this hoodie right now actually because I don't like being a hot person like I have to like sleep really cold, I have to, you know what I mean? Someone says you go to church. I used to, but I do want to go back into it just because I, I miss church. I mean, I haven't been there in like a few years and it'd be cool to go back and stuff and build my relationship with God and stuff. So yeah, even though he probably hates me. Someone says you have two siblings. I actually have four, I have four brothers. Pretty wild, pretty crazy. I'm the youngest though too, so yeah. Someone says you don't like the idea of long distance with Brandon, which is why it took you guys so long to date. That is very, very true. I was really iffy about it. I didn't really care for it. I didn't want to. But then you know what? It's Brandon. Like, you know, I want to make my effort into my relationship with my boyfriend. I want to, like, make it happen. So we found a way to make it happen, and it happened. So, yeah, no, we're happy together. It's almost been a year and a quarter. Um, that's crazy. Uh, someone says you are scared of everything. That's true and false. I mean, I just don't like sleeping at night by myself because like there's monsters under my bed, like monsters in the bathroom, and I just feel like really, really watched at night. Does anyone like really, I don't know, yeah, no? And that was the end of the assumptions, you guys. Nothing too bad, nothing too crazy saying like, oh, like, you know, like, oh, you're fake or something like, that's good. If you guys want another video like this, guys, please give this video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Also, press the notification bell. And again, guys, if you guys do want to be the shout out person of the week, don't forget to like, subscribe, turn on the bell, and comment pick me down below. Better notify you guys when I post new videos. That'll get you guys in the next week's video shout out. Maybe one of you guys or girls. So. Uh, one. I also have something 
for you guys real quick. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pull it out. Ooh, love this lighting when it's like only in one spot. So down here, you guys, we have some brand new brick merch, you guys. Something I think you guys would be very, very interested in. It just got really dark. I like that. This is the new merch, you guys. It says, I support brick with me and Brandon on it, you guys. And on the back, it has the day we started dating in Roman numerals. And it also has the two um, hearts on the side with the equal signs in them. So if you guys are interested in buying these, go to nickhorton.store. The link will be down below in the description or type this link in right here. They come in white and they come in red. So go order as many as you guys want. They will not last. They're only $4. So if you guys do want one, go to nickhorton.store, order your guys' before they do sell out. And yeah, but I love you guys all so much. I hope you guys have a great day. I'll see you guys soon for a new video. If you guys want to play Los Orlando, I will see you guys there. Hopefully you guys got the meetup because if you guys didn't, then we won't meet. But it's cool. I get it. No, I'm just kidding. But I love you guys so much. Have a great day. And I will see you guys soon for a new video. Bye, guys. Love you.